Hello, good morning children. I extend a warm welcome to you on this online teaching learning session. My dear children, if you remember, I was teaching you direct and indirect speech. So today I am going to explain you about the interrogative sentence. How to change the interrogative sentence from direct to indirect. So my dear children, there will be Interrogative sentences are in, made in two ways. You can make interrogative sentence in two ways. First is the which are started with the helping verbs. Helping verbs means here do, does, is, am, are, have, has, was, were, did, had, will, shall, can, could. This can, could are actually models but they are also behaving like helping verbs only so these are the helping verbs through which we can make sentences for example are you doing your work have you completed your work have you seen this movie so like this we are making the sentences with the help of helping verbs or you can with the help of uh, modals you can say can you can you swim nicely can you play cricket so this is the question that we make with the help of or would you like to have a cup of tea could you please help me so these are the sentences we can make with the help of modals might i help you may i help you may i go outside so these are the sentences that we can make with the help of this uh, helping words now so in place of said to in case of interrogative sentence said to change into asked or inquired of either said to change into asked or inquired of if or whether can be used in the indirect speech we we'll use if or whether for example you see ram said to lata are you reading a book Ram, Ram asked Lata if she was reading a book. So what we have done here? Said to change into asked. And in place of this comma inverted comma, we have put if. As either you can use here if or whether. So we have used here Ram asked Lata if. In place of you, it has come she here because we uh, the second person changes according to object here. So Lata is girl. So we have put here she and as this is R present continuous we have changed to past continuous. She was reading a book. Like that Rajesh said to Rajesh, where do you live? Now you see children this is WH family questions. If question is asked by WH like which, where, when, how, what, whom, these are the WH family and questions are asked through this WH also. So where do you live? Rajesh asked Rakesh where. This where will come here as it is and here this you changes into he because Rakesh is third person. So you changes according to Rakesh object here. This is second person. Second person always changes according to object. So where he live changes into live. This is simple Say this is simple present. Simple present changes into simple past. So this is the example I have shown you children. Now you can see many examples. Suppose for example, the teacher said, What's your name? What should mean? The teacher said, said into ask. The teacher asked the students. The teacher, if any nothing is there, you can use a student here. The teacher asked the student what his name was. What his name? What his name? was here you put full stop you remove this 
not a interrogative sentence. So interrogative marks will be removed, inverted commas removed and here full stop. So the teacher asked the student what his name was. So what will be seen? Then his name was. He changed into was here. So like this student we are changing in the interrogative sentence. Whatever sentences may be. I will send you some uh, questions for uh, revision, for practice and uh, you can do it. So my dear children, we have to do the practice of this interrogative sentence. Next sentence I will explain you imperative sentence. How to change the imperative sentences. So we will try to find out. Whenever WS family's questions will be asked here, you don't change anything. Okay, so simply you will not put E for whether if the question is asked through WS family, what, which, when, only you put simply, simply it will be like what his name was. Here we are not putting E for weather. So these are the two types of interrogative sentence that you have to keep it in your mind. And I send you some questions also. Just this is for just information. And next I will send you the questions and you can do practice. Thank you. Thank you so much my dear children. I hope you must have understood it and I am there with you. Don't worry. I will explain you imperative sentence next. Thank you.